And I mean, I do feel for you because, of course, you have been in the papers a lot. And going through a breakup's horrible, particularly when there are kids involved and everything. But normal people, when they go through a breakup, you know, you can then not see that person. Yeah. But in a high profile relationship, of course, you know, Gavin's there. He's on yeah. telly, he's doing strictly and everything. Yeah. Does that make it harder? I suppose it is, a, it is a little bit odd. It is pretty odd, but I think, you know, we're both, we've both been really grown up about the situation. I don't know how the hell we've managed to do that, but <laughs> we've both managed to be pretty grown up about it and just kind of do what's best for our beautiful little babbers. And I watch them on Strictly every week because the kids love it. Um, yeah, so it's, it's, it's okay. Are yeah. you voting for him? Of course. <laughs> well done. And right. how do you think he's doing? I think he's doing really well. I was really shocked, actually. I was really shocked. I think he's doing really well. Because, I have to say, this is odd for my mother to have this theory. Yeah. My mother <laughs> thinks he should have a drink before he dances. That's, that, is, that is something that Catch has apparently said to him as well. Oh, really? Yeah. My mother's so good, isn't yeah, she? Absolutely. Yeah, absolutely. <laughs> Alicia, get off that panel. <laughs> Rhoda's coming. What, what is this? It was like Dancing with the Stars. Yeah. Oh, OK. Yeah. And I have to say, right, cos I, I was working with you, yeah. and it seemed like, in my head, you know, one minute I'm going, and ladies and gentlemen, Charlotte Church has just become engaged, yay! Yeah. And then the next minute, all off. I mean, what, what happened? Um, well, I think it was th something that had been happening for a long time, to be honest, and uh, that was just kind of like our last chance at it because we had two young children, so we did really want to make it work, but we both just decided this is inevitable and we'd rather not do it when the kids are seven or eight or whatever, so just kind of, just kind of do it then, which was tough, but, you know, I, I think it would have been tough at any stage, to be honest.